morning, afternoon, evening, everybody, wherever you may be. Hello, and welcome back to another episode of Love Island. Does anyone out there remember who I am? I'm your new host, Lily, and I'm back again today to recap for you guys what happened last time. All has been going so well, so far so good, and there's yet to be a brawl. However, our cameras did catch a glimpse of Ryan and Lucy having a bit of a kerfuffle. Here's a quick look. Lucy, please don't do this. You and me belong together. We don't need them. Come on, let's ditch this place and get on the next boat out of here. I can give you everything you want if you give me a chance. Those other guys are nothing but no-gooders. I'll treat you right, Lucy. Uh, what do you say? Ryan, you need to leave me alone. Go home and let me get on with my life. I suggest you do the same. I don't love you, I never have, and I never will. Ouch, Lucy, that was a bit harsh, even if I say so myself. But apart from that little kerfuffle, do you think it will be this smooth sailing for the rest of their time here? Mm, I'm not so sure. The Islanders chose little Carly, little Kelly, and Lucy to be contestants on Flying Date. And Chad was their JT. We learned that Lucy apparently doesn't like the movies, and Carly is so romantic she's off the scale. While Kelly's hobbies include being a mermaid. I mean, who doesn't love a good lounge by the pool slash ocean? I'm surprised there wasn't much of a fight over the big pentos. The originals are being oddly nice to the newcomers, who were just kind of, well, taking over, it seems. So my question is, will it be Carly and Chad that are our power couple we're looking for? Hashtag Charlie. Or will Ropo and Scuba Steve sweep one of the new ladies off their feet? It's all been too nice for my liking. I'm starting to get a little bit suspicious. I think it's time for somebody new to join the island. And who could it be? Any guesses? Don't go anywhere. You won't want to miss this. Tune in right here, right now for this brand new episode of Love Island. Hey guys, check it out. Guess who's back on Love Island? It's little Donnie and I'm back here to cause some trouble. This is really weird being back in the diary room. Nobody knows I'm here. I'm on the island in a secret, so shush, don't tell anybody. This is very exciting. I've missed you guys so much, but more importantly, I'm here for revenge. Since I left, I had a lot of time to think and I realized that Kelly and Carly weren't actually that nice to me. We had a fling, but neither of them ever really wanted to win with me. I never had a fair chance and I got kicked off the island and that wasn't fair. I don't think either Carly or Kelly want to fall in love here on Love Island. They're just playing a massive game and I'm here to expose their lies. I'm not sure what my plan is yet but I do know that this place needs some drama. For now I'll be watching their every move in secret but soon all will be revealed and I can't wait to see their faces. See you guys! Oh guys this is amazing! Oh, I love this, it's so warm! It's Why are you in your scuba gear? What? I, 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 I'm not in my scuba gear. He's in his little his shorty worries. They they are very short shorts, bro. Yeah, they are pretty short. The um, shortest of shorts. They are tiny. <laughs> um, maybe we should go get some food, guys. I'm pretty hungry. And you shouldn't swim yeah. on an empty stomach. Oh, no, no it's the other way around. Anyway. You're not supposed to eat before you go for a swim. So it was a good idea to swim first, but I am starving now. And Kelly, I need you to cook some of that bacon that you're so good at. Ooh. Bacon. Yeah, let's go see what the kitchen has in the hotel. Maybe like, I can oh, that's bathroom. Stuff. Ah. Bathroom, don't go in there. Let's yeah. go downstairs. Is it, this is like kind of a, like a self-serve hotel kind of thing. Oh, there's the rest guys. So I wonder what they're up to. Um, okay, well, let's just stick together. Just us guys, because I mean, we are the originals, right? Do we actually have this hotel to ourselves? I think it's more of a like a mansion kind of a self-service kind of a place or something. Hmm, let me see. Uh, okay, there's nothing in the fridge. There's nothing Aww. in the cabinets. There's no food. This is the fire. This is where the fire is. Hotel fire. What? No. Wait. What does it say? It's, it's the foyer. Foyer. Ooh, that's, that's that is a fancy word. Oh, that is a fun. Ooh, look, food. Ooh, okay, that's no. Rita. 
Yeah, 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 yeah. Hold on, let me see. It says today's agenda. Oh, this is like old school Love Island. I love it. We're gonna have tasks and games and stuff. <gasps> no more stress and crazy robots and stuff. Okay, it says good morning, Islanders. Uh, are you excited for today's events? Hope you all have a good uh, sportsmanship. Hmm, Scoop Steve, not so much. Um, finish your breakfast and head to the pool to meet Lily. Ooh, Lily. Oh, she's the new uh, presenter girl. Mm -hmm. Guys, mm -hmm. all the food is plastic. I think it's what? just a show. It's just finish your breakfast. What are we supposed to this eat? Chicken is, this chicken isn't even real. Oh, no, there's probably the, something down by the beach. Maybe like a club sambo. Okay, I'm Ooh, the club sambo. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna, uh, oh, oh, no, I don't like tomato. Yeah, me neither. So just be. Oh, pigs. Be. Oh, bacon, 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 bacon. Don't bacon. Let me kill just... the pigs for don't, bacon. Come on, we'll check out the tiki bar. Put them in the pool. Food there. It killed oh, a lot. yeah, great oh. idea. Yeah. What what is like tiki food? Is that is that kind of like a Mexican influence or Cuba or something? Or what, what's tiki? I don't um, know. Sure. And Let's see. Refer sandwich. to your Google Maps. Okay, what? whatever. Cannibal. Oh no. Oh, oh, oh yes. Guys, there's I no food it. back here. Oh gosh, it's not good. I'm starving. What's up, guys? It's happening. <laughs> uh, everyone around here is so cool. Scuba Steve, we need to hit the gym, bro. Yeah, babe. What do you mean? Look at me. I'm buff. Mm. Look, 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 look. Where are you? Uh, I'm sorry, I, I went down the Guys, the presenter and... girl is here. Are we gonna have to find out where our agenda is? Ooh, oh, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Hi, hey, we're Lily. all here now. Ooh, hello, um... Lily. Oh, oh, sorry, sorry. Um, okay, no, continue. Such a creep. Continue. What? Ow, she's hot. You wanted to see us? What's going on? Good afternoon, guys. Thanks for joining me. How is everybody today? I hope you're feeling like you got a good sleep last night because today is jam-packed full of fun. You might be wondering why you have been split into two groups. Well, the producers thought the two challenges would be better than one. Whoever wins each challenge will be the winners of a romantic evening provided by this amazing beach resort. Who will be crowned the winners? Whose love will blossom? Carly, Kelly, Robo and Steve You'll be entering the Escape Room Challenge, which is set up across the road from the swimming pool, if you would like to make your way over there now. Ryan, Chad, Stacy, and Lucy, you'll be heading on over to the other challenge. That's enough for me, so let the games begin. Ooh, awesome. Well, uh, thanks so much, and uh, maybe, maybe uh, me and you can uh, talk, talk, uh, scoop, get, oh, seriously. She smells beautiful. Oh, guys. That sniffer you like You changed a dog, your dude. clothes. Uh, yes, you couldn't see me properly. No, you're invisible. <laughs> All right, guys, so what? what is this, like, escape rooms? This better not turn creepy and some weird guy's going to kidnap us and stuff. Like, I, I feel like stuff like that's going to happen all the time now. Ooh, this is a nice garden. Ooh, it is a nice garden. Is that a challenge fruit or fruit one? Lemon trees. So who's ready <gasps> to hear the results? Oh, no, wait, we can, like, make fruit, fruit drinks and cocktails. Oh, challenge today are... Guys, we got a mission at hand here. Come on, yeah, let's shoot. That's, that could this be another challenge. Killing. We better leave that Are you ready there. for this? Fruit picking challenge. This is, this is, this is Stacy from group one and Scuba Steve Ooh. from Ooh, group let's see. two. Let's just see. I wonder if there's a way into the escape rooms. Then we'll just get out that way. Yeah, that could be There's just a door here. Yeah, yeah. Oh, oh no, it's I, locked. No, it's oh, locked. okay, okay. Well, obviously, maybe it's on a time release thing and it'll open or something like that. So, Carly, have you got. What is that? Where did you get a sword? It's a eucalyptus sword. Ooh, that's pretty cool. Okay, guys, let's get pumped and get ready. Remember, the key to this is teamwork. Are you guys ready? Yes, let's do it. Let's go, guys. No, 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 wait, 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 wait. It's not, it's not teamwork because one of us has to win because then one of us gets a date. Yeah, but it's teamwork to get out of the rooms, and then at the end, we can double-cross each other and backstab each other. You ready, guys? Uh, that sounds like a plan. <laughs> okay, guys, I've never done one of these things before, um, so let's just go in. I'm yeah. scared. I, I, I like found a way in. Yes, escape. <laughs> What's it? Enter rooms or escape rooms? Yeah, I Welcome think it's escape room room. One. We tried to start at the back there, um, so that was obviously the way out. So um, let me see if I can just smash this. Okay, look, like there's a chest over here. Uh, there is an instructions. Ooh. And a and a guys, table, and a table. Guys, we're trapped, we're trapped. I can't smash the lock, I can't smash it up. <laughs> oh, wait, so you small. let me the read so my, small. let me read the instructions. So okay, welcome to today's challenge. Have you guessed what it might be? You must escape through all four rooms to win the challenge. You should play as a team to get out fast. Whoever is the first person through the last door is crowned our winner. The winner of this challenge will be treated to a delicious evening meal and can be accompanied by the winner of the other group. Let the games begin. And we have a table. 
Ooh, okay, what, is, what does the table mean? Guys, uh, uh, I saw a ladder and I, I got, this says hint number two. Oh, okay, Ooh, okay. read it, read okay, it. Okay, okay, it said, well read done, it. code number two. Use the second part of this code to complete this room. Hint, Winnie the Pooh, good luck. Four? Ooh. Winnie the Pooh? So four for poo, no? Oh. But what, why would it be four for poo? What are you talking about? Because it's four letters in the word poo. Poo. Four. But we know it was. Okay, well, we. The code. Well wait, done. the code to this chest, okay, which obviously has the key, is going to be four numbers. So, yeah. what was the hint number one? Because we got hint number two, but we haven't seen hint number one. Oh, missing... I found it. Code one. Okay. I found it. Oh, okay. Cool, cool. What is this? What is this? What is this? Use the first code to break the chest. Two fat ladies. <gasps> Guys, it's like. Oh, these are bingo things. So two fat ladies. 22! Um, no, I think the answer is 42! No, no, no. Two fat ladies, 88. And then Winnie the Pooh is 42. The bingo call. So 8842. Guarantee Ooh. you that's eight, eight, it. 8842. Let me try it. 8842. Boom! Got it! Got it. Oh, oh, next room, next room. Open it, open it, open it. Hey, I had no idea that Winnie the Pooh was 42. That's pretty cool. Ooh. Yeah, that's, it's a thing. It's a thing. Okay, no, oh, let me... Oh, here's a pig. Dinner time! <laughs> yes, let's forget about the challenge. I'm eating this pig. Oh, wait, there's a chest Bacon. here. A clear okay. one. Okay, I'll read it. I'll read it. You ready? Yeah. Uh, welcome to room two. You are one step closer to love. You need to find the key. Where or where could it be? Do you have a sweetheart? Would you give them a love heart? Oh, oh, the love heart up here. Look. Oh, love heart. Okay, clue number two. It says, uh, well done. You found me. Can you work this out? What is half a century plus four dozen? If you can figure it out, get to the chest. Half a century plus four dozen and 98. What? It is 98 in total, but 98 is just one. Hold on, so half a century oh, is 50, 50 am I right? and 48. So will I try 5048? Yes. Oh, whoa, we are awesome. Scuba Steve, you are rocking this, dude. Oh, <laughs> I got a blue key, people. Open it, open it, open it. Open it. Awesome, Gosh, guys. We're already finished room two. This is like... We are okay. Open it, open it, open it, open it. No, 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 wait, wait, wait. <laughs> you are never leaving. I've got the key. Beat him up. Okay, no. I'm just gonna walk out back this way. See you guys later. Stop it, stop. I'm kidding. <laughs> okay, room number three, guys. We are crushing this. All right, sweet. Uh, uh, do, 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 do. Okay, I'm presuming there's something in this chest. Okay, it says guidance for, for what this says. Okay, let, let me read this thing. Um, it says, you have made it to room three. You must be uh, filled with glee. Oh, that rhymes. That's awesome. Uh, there are two numbers to collect. Who knows where they might have been left? Search high and low and see what you are looking for, my show. Okay, hmm? here's a second clue. Kelly, you read that one. Oh, no, you read it. You haven't read one in a while. No, I just read one. Here. Okay, okay. Uh, let me see. Let me see. Okay, clue number this is two. Tough. Important clue, can you combine one dozen with a royal salute? Be fast to move and you're gonna be the winner. Hmm. What's a royal salute? I'm not sure. Hey, oh, guys, hold on. Has anyone got a shovel or a pick pickaxe or anything? Oh, 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 I have my eucalyptus sword. Oh, be, oh what, 12. Some... It says 12. It says 12. Are you I... sure? Yeah. It does say 12. Look, the letter 12. The letter 12. Okay. Yeah. Definitely a number, bro. So wait, is that the first <laughs> clue? Because this is clue number two. What did it say again? Okay. Say it again. Important clue. Can you combine one dozen with a royal salute? One What's dozen a royal... is 12. And yeah. a royal salute is 21. Wait, this door is open. Are we meant to use this room as well? No. Nope. Oh. No. What? Oh. What? Oh, no, wait. Here's the chest. You have to put it in here. Oh, yeah. Put it in here. Yeah. No, we're in room four. Ah! <laughs> they made a mistake. There's no lock on this one. <laughs> oh, they didn't put a lock. Oh my goodness. Oh, no, I think maybe, it's, maybe it's for this thing. Oh, Wait, no, don't go in there. Don't go in there. I'm so confused. I mean, there's locks everywhere. We need to get the gold key, but we don't know where the clues are. There's a force field here that you can't walk through. Oh, what? Oh. Don't walk through there. You oh, I know. I can't. I can't. Oh. That's the whole point. I can't. Uh, okay, uh, okay maybe there's something we're missing like upstairs in here. Okay, so there was that clue in there. There's a TV with nothing on it. Royal salute. I've no idea what that could be. Oh, oh, oh! Scuba Steve, you were right again! I knew it! 12, 20, 12, 12, 20, 12 21. 21. I tried. Open, 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 open! Oh, man, that is insane. Scuba Steve, I can't believe you got that! Okay, okay, um, wait. Hold on a second. Does that mean we've got another goal key here? So, well, here, and let me just... Oh, oh, here's a... I dropped it. Okay. I, I, I'm reading something. It says, winner, winner, chicken dinner. If you're the first person to escape, then 
take with you this invitation to treat yourself to a romantic evening by the beach with the winner from the other challenge. Yeah, the winner. Uh, we'll still see you in Reddit, so I guess he gets the win. win. Yes! Oh, yes! Oh, okay, okay. Oh. You yes. know what? I've got to admit it, Scuba Steve, you were definitely the best in there, man. You got all of those. That was pretty awesome. So, oh, wait. Oh, my goodness. I bet you Brad won. You're going to have to go on a date with Brad. Wait, you're <laughs> going to have to make sure to keep that winner voucher because someone might steal it from you. Mm -hmm. Oh, but you've got a sword Ropo. and she's standing beside me. Well, she's got a sword and she's standing no, right beside no, me. No, stand on that chair. Okay, I'm Definitely. the winner. Ah! <laughs> I'm right, the winner. Guys, okay. Come on, let's get back over to the presenter who's still half by the way and uh, see who won the other challenge. Dun, dun, dun. Was that a challenge or what? So who's ready to hear the results? I can now reveal to you our winners of the challenges today are... Eek! Ah, oh, this suspense is killing me. Are you ready for this? Stacy from group one and Scuba Steve from group two. How exciting is this? You better go get ready, guys. Ooh, Scooby Ooh. and Stacy. Ooh, you guys are going on a hot date. Which, which one is you? The one, one in the blue, dude. Blue sea is my one. Boom, baby. Stay <laughs> Stay. Hey. Oh, guys, guys, guys. We should definitely spy on. I mean, I mean, nothing. Uh, enjoy your date, but um, wait, wait, wait. Oh. Hang on a minute. Little Carly didn't get her date with um, was it Ryan or Chad? Chad. Chad. And now you have your date, so I guess you're gonna get to go on a double date. Oh, oh double, double date. date action. Ooh, I cannot wait for the next episode. We're going to have drama. That'll be so much fun. 